culture and tourism media brand Gogay Africa and its partners have unveiled the Destination West Africa project, an initiative established to promote tourism within the sub-region. The unveiling, which was held over the weekend in Lagos, had in attendance various tourism experts who identify the barriers that impede intra-Africa travels, tourism, trade and investment in West Africa sub-region. According to the organizers, the advocacy for intra-Africa tourism will help showcase the beauty of African common heritage, cultural similarities and diversity with one another and the global community. If you're going to America, you would pay less going to America than if you're going to Cape Verde, which is about three, four hours away in Nigeria. So in, in, in West Africa. So why is that? So it's all these barriers. If you, if you travel by road, you get to the borders, you see the kind of stress you face. They put you through all kinds of stress. So these are some of the challenges we want to reduce so that West Africans can get to know each other. And of course, we on our part, Gogi Africa and the Destination West Africa team, would visit different West African countries, spotlighting the tourism potential, the business, the trade, the commerce, and then the culture, so that West Africans can get to know each other. Because if they know each other, they would not, they would have reason, more reason to want to travel, and of course, be lend their voices to lowering of barriers, traveling intra Africa, intra West Africa. With this now, I think it will be a way to come together, have a, some discussion, particularly with the government agencies, to see how we can have a single, a, one basic concept of when you want to travel, if you won't pay, if you're paying to go anywhere within the sub-region, you're just paying once and the government will have to work out how they share the sharing formula rather than each country giving you hassles and when you're going to come in, it's always a, a, a problem. And then uh, we haven't also exploited the, the tourism potentials of the uh, uh, West Africa sub-region. It hasn't, it's just, it's, it's, in fact, I don't know, it's just, it's just a scratch on the surface. We need to dig deeper in. Because there are a lot of tourist attractions, a lot of places where we share within the coastline, we share a lot. I've been to Elmina Castle, I, I know what I saw. I've been to the Gambia, I know what I saw. Uh, even Republic of Benin. So we see things happening. Look at Badagri, why don't you just exploit it?